Trick at the Professional Poker Player. Hi Sam. Hiya. How is it going? Uh, it's going good now. Um, nothing really happened for the first few hours. And the, the last time of the break I just doubled up to like 110,000 so it's going alright. Okay. Uh, last year was a very good year for you. Yeah. And uh, you played uh, high stakes cash games with uh, famous uh, poker players like Tom Dwan and Patrick Antonius and uh, Phil Ivey. How was it? Yeah, it's brilliant. It was a good test for your game. Um, obviously, it's, you wouldn't want to play with these guys every day because they're really good and give you lots of tough decisions, but it's, uh, it's kind of how you improve uh, playing against the best. So, um, felt like I overcome the challenge and went well for me, so I'm um, like, overwhelmed with how the year went. Do you play different when you play against them than not normal against the normal players? Um, I try not to play the same against uh, everybody. I don't really play a specific style against anyone. I just um, I tend to think like think a lot more. Don't just make like quick quick calls or quick quick folds or whatever. Um, I try and think about it a little bit more because I know they're capable of all, all the plays. So um, I feel like I've done all right out there. At the one of the tables, you play against two Chinese uh, businessmen. How was it to play against Asian players? I love it. Like. Um, it's the most fun atmosphere game there is uh, I've ever played. Like um, everyone's joking, everyone looks at each other's cars, join hands and stuff. Uh, people show each other bluffs, and uh, so they're also good fun to play with because their styles are really good to play with as well. And like they're not going to sit there and fold all night. They're going to play pretty aggressive and give you tough decisions, and uh, you're going to give them tough decisions, and uh, it's, it's good. I, I enjoy playing out there. Do you prefer to play more against Asian players than uh, Western players? Um, it's hard to like categorise Western and Asian, but like I prefer playing in Macau, um, if that's how I'd put it, just because the game's loads more fun. Like um, I come back and played this tournament today, and I'm kind of bored. Like just sat there folding, and you kind of have to fold. Like, I'm kind of a little bit bored of tournaments at the minute, so I've been trying to play cash a bit more this year. Okay. But uh, it's all right. Uh, I'd say it's like playing with anyone that's fun to play with. Yeah. And uh, you play Omaha as well. Do you consider yourself a better Omaha player or a Texas Hold'em player? Um, I would say I'm a better Hold'em player. Um, I'm more experienced in Hold'em, and uh, um, like I, I feel like I know the spots better. And like, I just feel like my edge is a lot bigger when I play Hold'em because I think you have more control over the pots and whatever you you can like sort of dictate how big the pot gets yourself rather than Omaha. You tend to be like all in with like decent equity a lot and. Obviously, it's a lot higher than average game, so I feel like I'm a bit more controlled in Holden. I think everybody is. I think it's just that type of game. Are you planning to play more televised games then this year? Uh, yeah, I, sh I should do really. Um, I I'll like play any cash, big cash game they invite me to. Like, um, I'll probably play high stakes as well this year if it, if it goes. Um, I'm going to play all the Premier League tournaments and what have you, and probably the million dollar buy in tournament in the World Series as well. So, I'll just play like all the bigger buy in stuff and uh, hopefully all the televised cash games too. Okay, I hope you the best of luck then. Thank, Thank you. For your